Welcome to our brand new podcast. You guys have been waiting, and the time has finally come. Vinny and Ryan, you better sub, or you're going to get punched and knocked the fuck out. Get that Nintendo right hook, baby. Wait, I'm looking at the playback on a computer, so they changed this. It used to be where I would be the top and Ryan would be the bottom or vice versa. Now we're just like two rectangles right next to each other. It looks pretty sweet. I wonder what it looks like for other people on mobile. Yeah, no, it looks like we're in a Nintendo short. Like, you're on the left, I'm on the right. <laughs> right? Yeah, this is crazy. Also, yeah. King Alchemist is in the building. What's up, King? Waiting for the rest of the squad to show up. Ryan, how you doing tonight, bud? Dude, I'm doing good. New year, new podcast. No one knew this Bro, show was coming. you know what, man? 2024 hit, and me and Ryan, we were scheming, right? We're like, yo, what could we do? And Ryan was <laughs> no. like, yo, how about a podcast? And I says to him, you know what? Let's fucking run it. What topics are we going to cover? And he goes... Whatever the fuck, baby. And this is how it was born, you know? And this is the Vinny and Ryan podcast show. Here we are. Bro, it's the Vinny and Ryan. Yeah, I, you know what? Let me adjust the title. The Vinny and Ryan podcast show. Let me go ahead and edit that while I'm live. Here we go. Hold on. All right. So, chat. Y'all are y'all bring the topics. We bring the podcast. Let's go. Yeah. So, basically, the structure of our podcast is that you guys ask us a, a question, right? Mm. And then we podcast yeah yeah yeah. that that's the whole that's the whole podcast that's that's pretty much the gist of it you are not late jose you're actually right on time we've been live for a minute and 40 seconds and i hope the title adjusted because ryan's right this is not the Vinny and ryan show this is the Vinny and ryan podcast show we have a whole new title we rewrite we rebranded two minutes in (laughs) listen sometimes in life you gotta just change course all right you might think your life is going on this one singular path, and all of a sudden you get hit by a bus. You gotta go. Oh, no, way. not the bus. <laughs> the bus can come and hit you. What language would you learn if you could choose any language? I'm so glad someone brought this up because this is something that I want to talk about deeply on the Vinny and Ryan podcast show. I would say Italian because I'm Italian and I can't speak it. That's a cool, cool answer. Cool answer. Yeah, because I want to be like, uh, "Ciao, mi chiamo Vincenzo e tu." That was that was actually pretty good. That was actually really good. That Chef, was, was that, was that right? real or is he bluffing? No, I mean that was that was my name is Vinny or Vincent. What is yours? Simply my name put. Is Ryan. Uh, oh host shit! Of the Vinny and Ryan podcast show. Actually, oh, good <laughs> to meet you. You know, I don't need this mic, but I kind of feel like to make it more podcasty, I should yeah, just but... put this here, right? There we go. Now, now we're officially a podcast. <laughs> Yo, honestly, I'm changing the title again, bro. The Vinny and Ryan the Super podcast, 2024, the, baby. The Vinny and Ryan Super Podcast Show. We have a new title. All right, let me this go ahead. Let me link podcast. in the description too. Very important. At King Corfish, bam. So yeah, I mean, again, guys, this is something that we've been planning for. Oh my god, dude. So like, long. So long. It, you know the reason why everything looks so good and the art's so on point and the mm. and the dynamic is so fucking good. Again, <laughs> is because this has been mo- no, honestly, years of prep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, we we brought this up years back, actually. That's uh, dude yeah. to see it finally be here. <laughs> it's it, it it feels so good. It's so it's so, real. It's so been... surreal because we were wondering like, should we have the pretend mics? And that's something we didn't know until that's true. You know, we until got we were it. In it. Yeah. Hey, Vinny, well, what's your recommendation we were... on treadmills? Ooh, mm. to get serious for the first time in this entire video and Ryan Super <laughs> Podcast show, I would say. Um, do your research. I know the Norda tracks are really good. When I was doing research on what treadmill I wanted, I know the Norda tracks are sick. I ended up getting the Peloton because I really like doing the live classes and stuff. But uh, they do say the Peloton is a bit overpriced for the amount of hardware that you are getting. I'm not sponsored by either of these companies, but I would say do your research and definitely uh, figure out which one would be best for you. Also, Scott, thank you so much for being a member. Ryan, any any treadmill talk? Uh, none that I can say from personal experience, but we could throw the walking pad in this conversation too. You've been loving yes. that this year. Yeah. Yes. I, uh, I don't know off the top of my head which walking pad I have, but I'm pretty sure if you go on Amazon, you just type in walking pad. One of those is the one that I got. Kylie actually stole it and brought it upstairs to her office. Uh, so I, I currently don't have a walking pad down here, but don't worry. I'm going to bring it back down. It was this whole thing. My camera tripod is balancing right now on this like piece of poster board like a metal poster board. I know that sounds weird, but it's pressed up against the wall and that's what the treadmill's back foot is on. But we don't have to talk about that during the Vinny and Ryan Super Podcast show. I'm glad we added the Super into the show. We didn't feel right until the Super was in there. Exactly. Honestly, it's a work in progress. Like I said, you know, we've been, 
I mean, we had so many names. At one point, we were just going to call it The Fuck. Like, literally, <laughs> just The true. Fuck. But yeah, I thought it was a little fuck. too aggressive. Um, yeah, yeah. At one point, it was uh, there once was a man named Michael Finnegan and Ryan and Vinny. That one, honestly, was sticking for, for quite a bit. Yeah, it, um, thing, things fell out with Michael, and we just couldn't add him to the show. So Yeah, yeah. he just he got, really, he got really aggressive towards the end of our friendship. Yeah. I don't know really what happened. Yeah, no, the yeah. dynamic just wasn't there. We couldn't bring that to the podcast. It was just... Exactly. Was so, you know, yeah. then we just decided on the Vinny and Ryan show. Um, but then literally right when we started the show, we just felt it needed a super podcast show in front yeah. of it. Mm -hmm. Like two minutes in, you should have been there. You should have been there. Yeah, yeah. So what did you yeah. do today, Ryan? Dude, I worked on an ad read. I recorded w? it. it. Made a thumbnail. Hell yeah. I uh, got a new mic. What What are these things called? The cover. Uh, the, the pop filter stuff. Yeah. Yeah, no. I yeah. got a new one off Amazon. Just came in this morning. So that Fuck was good. yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Yeah, I got to order new ones, too, because Ari, this is like her favorite thing to eat. She just Aww. devours it, you know? Aww. <laughs> she's, a little, she's a little crazy goober. She started biting on Kylie's today, too. Kylie's no. got the blue one over here. But, no. you know, maybe in the next podcast episode, we could have, you know, a guest on and, you know, give them that mic. Or I'm not sure. Can you add three people into this? We got to text Frank. I think we have to. And I'm also wondering, okay, so yeah, you can't adjust. I want to know what this looks like on a phone. Like on a mobile stream? Yeah. Okay, so like for me, it has like both me and you as our rectangles and the chat's like underneath it. Yeah, but what are the people seeing? I don't have another phone nearby. Yeah, you think I can load this on my Nintendo Switch? <laughs> Be live on the Switch. <laughs> can you guys describe to us in the chat what this looks like? Is it the greatest Rest thing you've ever seen? What are y'all seeing? What are y'all seeing? <laughs> Also, any uh, podcast topics, leave them down in the chat. Yeah, any anything you got. Again, the backbone of this show, and this is what me and Ryan really discussed a mm -hmm. long time coming, was the audience is the backbone of the show. The audience is the backbone. We're men just of the people, split screen. Really. So, wait, so when you say split screen, like, what does it look like, though? Is it just me and Ryan next to each other? Because we won't fit a full mobile. Why would they change it from the top and bottom? Doesn't that seem counterintuitive? Yeah. Well, I've seen the first iteration of the podcast, the Frank and Vinny show, and that yeah. was the vertical format. I, I like it. We're coming into this with a new format, actually. Interesting. It's kind of like Minecraft vertical sp split screen. Oh, it is vertical. So it is top and bottom. So who's on the top? Who's on the bottom? Well, it, it better is. be me. I'm, I'm top. I'm top. Listen, I'll be a bottom. I don't care. I, I, I look good on either part of the screen. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> oh it's just God. black on the left and the right edge. I gotta, work. I gotta, I gotta know what this looks like, dude. I gotta get a new phone. <laughs> I guess I could just pull it up after the show is over. There we go. There we go. See we'll see in post. We'll see in post. It looks like Drake and Josh, but Ryan is Josh. Oh no, my God. I'm Drake. No, oh God. Drake. This is, no, this no, is no, 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 This no. is awkward. This guys, my, my ex co-host is here. Oh boy. <laughs> um. Hey, yeah, so. bud. Hey. Uh, happy new year new new show new year it's like running into your ex like this is uh See, you I... uh you breaking any more records lately <laughs> oh boy I'm to have this I'm, I'm gonna give you all your space this seems uh, like it's a, an does, ab uh, conversation i'm gonna see myself out real quick does frank have a question for the podcast, for the podcast. Ooh, uh, this is uncomfy i don't feel great spinoff guys i'll see y'all next week fair enough fair <laughs> enough oh wait yeah. kevin just sent me a picture of what it looks like on twitter so let me let me take Ooh. a gander because i have my my main pc right in front of me and where can we follow you on twitter Vinny? at Vinny, and you can follow ryan at king corfish let's do it let's That's get it so <laughs> interesting. yeah it's just too it's just too Vertical, vertical YouTube. I gotta, I gotta ask somebody on YouTube what's going on over here, dude. Because that's not. Yo, what it looks Omega like for TKJ us. said topic Wait. of discussion. They never made a car too. Honestly, that's a Ryan. That's I'll, I'll just pivot that right to Ryan. Don't even because I've actually started. never seen cars. Fun fact. Well, you're never gonna see a cars too because there isn't one. The thing is, yeah. is when it comes to this series of movies, Disney put out a cars. And then a few years later, they skipped Cars 2, and they just dropped Cars 3. If you it, think about it, it's it's kind of a marketing genius move, because people are going to say, where the fuck is Cars 2? Newsflash, there is there none. 
there is none. And now we're talking about the movie, and it's like, well, I guess we could check out Cars 3. And bang. Right. And they, Pixar knew. Like, Pixar knew that eventually podcasts like the Vinny and Ryan Super Podcast Show. Mm. By the way, I know this whole thing is a bit, but I'm not even going to lie, that's kind of fire. <laughs> it actually, it rolls off the tongue. It, really, really it well. reminds <laughs> me of the Super Mario Bros. Super Show. <laughs> yes! <laughs> so good! Why is this it was too- once we added in the super, that name really stuck. No, hundred percent. And honestly, we we did it together because it was the Vinny and Ryan show, and then you mm-hmm. said podcast, and I said super, and, and that's what we are. We're super podcasters. We we build. We are super podcasters. That's what we, we are. We are. Uh, we're a Minecraft creeper. That, does that make sense? Do they do? Because because we blow up the YouTube algorithm. Where with our... where my whoa! I can whoa! Zoom in. Wait wait! You can zoom whoa. in. No, no way! No, you know what? There's Yo, now we're place. a super podcast. Hold on, hold on. We're the Vinny and Ryan Super Zoom. <laughs> super Zoom. I'm going to adjust it. Podcast show. I'm Thanks. glad my microphone's still in frame, so we're a podcast. Yeah, no. Yes! Listen, <laughs> this is all very important. I'm realizing right now, when I don't have, like, a head, I have a very big forehead. Like, look at how little my face looks. Yeah, no, wait, we can line up our eye levels, line up the nose levels, and, like, you just... Yeah, that's good. You can, you can land a helicopter on that. Bro, forehead. literally. I mean, your hair is covering yours, but, like, I clearly have a large forehead. Large. The zoom very, does not do any favors. Very large and in charge. Um, but, yeah, so if we if we want to stop being silly billies, I call uh, Ari Silly Millie a lot. That's one of her nicknames. So, basically, um, I've been, like, doing shit all day, chat, like, nonstop. One of those, like, exhausting, was going to post that sleepy Charmander as the thumbnail for this and just do an old mobile stream in bed. But I was like, yo, I want to bring the people something fresh. And then I was like, I wonder if Ryan's up. I literally just said, yo, you up? Man was <laughs> up. And I was like, want to go live with me for a little bit? He's like, yeah, dude, let's do it. And then the Vinny and Ryan <laughs> show was born. And, and then it was born, you know, and, and here we are. Yo, Vinny, how's the new puppy? R-Y-X, uh, thank you so much for the super chat. She's so good. Um, she had a little bit of alone time tonight when we were having some dinner and she was, she was going a little crazy, but you know, we're, we're giving her her little moments of alone time each day and slowly making it more and more. And she's, she's not really loving it just yet. So hopefully that gets better as we go. But dude, she's so sweet. She's basically the third member of the soul link. Now every soul link episode, she's just there, uh, being crazy, but yeah, puppy life has been good. It's, It's honestly, my anxiety has been very calm because she's been like, so just, so so much attention is going to her and like making sure she's okay and she's all good. It's it's been great. It's been really good. Dude, I love that. I love that. I love getting we, all these area updates every day. Like every day it's oh, dude. <laughs> I've also been like forcing her into like a bunch of Nintendo shorts. We haven't done any new ones since you've been home, but we'll definitely mm. do that when when you get when you're ready to start cooking again. Cause I did uh AI fusions today. Mm-hmm. And I had Dylan guessing and the last fusion was Airy and a Pikachu and it was like an electric Italian Greyhound, and it was, oh, it was amazing, dude. It was dude. amazing. Oh, I love that. I love that. By the way, huge shout out to Hat Guy, who has been fucking cooking, dude. Go, like, Hat Guy. Man's been killing it. And I know the three of us, the three of us can get into a call this week and start cooking some stuff as well. Like, yo, Team team Vinten dudes, we we out Vinten here, Squad chat. elite, baby. By the way, if none of, well, for those of you guys that aren't subscribed to Ryan, make sure you all go sub to Ryan. He's linked down below. Kyle said, this is the angle we've all been waiting for. This is how all content should be recorded from now on. I agree. agree. And, you know, I can even take it a step further. The bottom line. Wait, let's let's literally fuse. Wait, so let's do this. Wait. Zoom out so your nose will be the other half of my nose. Gotcha, Uh, gotcha. And then slide it over. Go the other way. Okay, hold on, wait. Go. Yep. Now, Now zoom in a little bit. A little. A little bit more. <laughs> I hope this is working for everybody else. This is terrifying. We fusion hot. This we're is like act- on my screen. Like this is a perfect Vegeta. fusion. <laughs> oh my god, that's so scary. That is so. Wait, let me pull it up on the computer to make sure that's working. On my oh, end, it looks great. On the <laughs> oh no! Fuck! On the on the on the actual stream, it's it's flipped. Wait, go this way. Okay. Will that work? Hold on. Wait, I'm, I'm updating in real time. It's updating in real time. This is so funny. Okay, yeah. No, no. Now you go, wait, you gotta go to the other side. Okay, like this. So you gotta go there. Yes, hold on, let it update. 
I'm trying not to move, but it's so zoomed in. Hold on. Here it comes. Here it comes. Yo, we're fused. Yo, we're Gogeta. We're fucking Gogeta, bro. Few. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, we actually look demented, dude. If I saw this on a street corner, I'd run for my life. Dude, our eyes are moving. Ew, ew, we have to stop. It's too much. Yeah, yeah no, that, oh. that's too much super for this podcast. No, that was that was way too much. Thank you so much to Dalton. If Nintendo called and said you guys could could never play one of their games, which one would you play for YouTube? Could mm-hmm. never play another one. Wait, so we're asking which game could we never play again? Wait, like it's a choice? If Nintendo, if Nintendo called and said you could never play another one of their games, what would you play for YouTube? Oh, I get the question. So if we couldn't do Nintendo games. Oh, is there anything else that we could do? I, I became probably, a Spider-Man tuber this year, so I'm, I'm covered. <laughs> I'd probably just load up Club Penguin. Yeah. And yeah. fucking grind Club Penguin. Or, or the Sandwich Stacker from the Disney Channel uh, website from back in the day. Where you would run around <laughs> as Experiment Six Two Five and catch the the cold cuts. That's what I would play. Oh, the the sandwich stacker game. From I would be a Disney. sandwich stacking YouTuber. That would that would be the plan. <laughs> sandwich Saturdays. That'll yeah. be the plan. <laughs> also, Master Arcanine with the five. Thank you, buddy. Said I just realized this year is going to be the five year anniversary of the Leaf Green Three Way Co op. When season two coming? You two. We actually should do that. No. Wait, Honestly, wait, we should we should for, drop for the next too. thing for the next thing we do on your channel, Ryan? If Frank's down, I will I will gladly show up for that. That Let's would be hilarious. No, Which I think I think a five year hiatus know, is just what we need, and then we can come back like stronger than ever. Honestly, <laughs> if you're not taking five years in between projects, also yeah, hold on a second. That's fucking crazy. That's five weird. Years. That's weird. <laughs> I don't like that. Right? Where's five years gone? Right. Well, okay, five years ago was when I first moved to Georgia. So, like, this is my five-year anniversary of, like, living here and doing this. Do you want to hear the craziest shit, too? That's crazy. This February is my 10-year on YouTube. <laughs> That's fucking oh, nuts. Also, what's up, V? So, so, I want to tell you guys, I have... I, ha- I actually haven't even told Ryan yet, because we haven't really talked, because my man's been in uh, in Detroit. But, uh... In a world I have... I have celebrations planned for a bunch of different things. When I tell Ryan the storyline of all this shit, I guarantee you know, he he's going to lose his mind. It's going to be hype. I, I don't want to tell you guys just yet, but just know for the for the 10 year anniversary and for the five years straight of streaming in March. Oh, I, I got I got an idea. I got something cool. Yeah, because, like, all of that's, like, happening around the same time. Literally, oh. dude. It's it's wild. But I, I won't get into details. I'll just say I'm coming up with some with some cool shit. Dude, whatever it is, can I be a part of it? Like, whatever it is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah! We'll, we'll, we'll talk, we'll talk, for sure, for sure. Oh, uh, Max said, real talk, we need to bring back the Vinny that knew nothing about My Hero and Loki made fun of it. Dude, the fact that I used to call my favorite anime now My Hero Macadamia Nuts is like, <laughs> it's, it's actually It's actually fucking wild. Dude. No, okay, so on Dylan's subathon the other night, he was playing old Core 4 videos, and we were talking about My Hero, but this is like years before you watched it. <laughs> so Dylan was like, name four characters, and you just whisked it off bullshit the whole time. <laughs> And like, wait, you remember so one that I talked about this show like years prior to now it's your favorite thing ever. <laughs> That's crazy. Yo, and we're going to attack these Titans. Yeah, Attack on Titan and My Hero, for whatever reason, I would always fucking take a dump on them. And then they became like my two favorite shows. That's so funny. Which is crazy. Also, Dalton with the five. So will there ever be a core four generation race? I thought the idea was revolutionary for the PokeTuber community. I would <laughs> probably. Okay, so here's the thing. First of all, thank you so much for the five. You know, they, they say never say never. <laughs> I think Ryan would attest. I, I would assume that will never happen. That would probably because never happen. You would need to get me, Ryan, Frank, and Dylan to play every Pokemon game in a row in Let's Play format. And then, then the conversation's like, what fucking channels? Where's it going? Who's editing this? Like, it would... I'm there's just going to go off on a limb and say, listen, there's a 0.0001% chance that anything could happen, I guess, but probably not. Hey, we'll, we'll write that one down just for you. That <laughs> one, that one's getting written. Yo, can we fucking play Borderlands already? <laughs> I've been can waiting we address, for you to Can ask we address you. that? Dude, <laughs> wait, every no, no. day, wait, let me, let me check it out on Twitter right now. Every day we get asked to play Borderlands and this dude, this dude has been cooking 
<laughs> for literally what? It's like a thousand days now, right? A thousand six hundred thirty-five days. Hold on, do you know? Someone has been tweeting oh, to no, us yeah, for every single day for yeah. sixteen hundred days yeah. to get the, the core board to play the board. Spy man. guy at the spy guy three eight four. This was tweeted today at two forty nine p.m. By the way, day sixteen hundred thirty five of asking United Hayes, Vinny Asteroid, and King Corbin to play Borderlands. Get the core four to play Borderlands. And if you click that, actually, if you click that hashtag, nothing pops up. But I feel like all of his tweets should pop yep, up. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> oh, there they are. Yep, it just didn't load on my end. <laughs> Shit. Like he's dedicated. I'm down whenever, whenever we can light up a Borderlands day. <laughs> Listen, I'm I am so down to do that. Also near the north. How are you, man? So happy to see your hard work paying off. Area's so cute. Keep up the great content, Vinny. Borderlands one and two. Do it. First of all, I hope you are well near the north. You are an absolute legend, brother. Thank you so much for all of your support, generosity. I hope all is well. And thank you so much for for stopping by to the Vinny and Ryan Super Zoom podcast show. Like that's Super that, Zoom podcast that's show. a that's a damn honor, bro. It really it is. It really is. You are here for the pilot episode. The historic this is episode indeed, one. That's true. This is the pilot episode. I don't think people remember that. By the way, near the north, for those that don't know, he was our number one top member gifter for the longest time. Actually, wow. recently, Rampant, uh, Rampant B L W D B Z, which is a badass name in his own right. <laughs> Both names are badass. Rampant recently became the top gifter of all time. But shout out to Rampant near the north. Snarf is number three. Thank you to all the top gifters. Also, with the help of GBL today, I was able to get a lot of uh, new stream stuff organized. So I don't even think I've told Ryan this yet. So you're gonna you're gonna get the scoop here as well. Actually, I'm gonna read the super chat first. I'll give you guys the four one one. Yo, Pink King with the five said, "When are we getting two v two Soul Link versus Vinny K Dog and versus Frank and Ryan Bromance versus True Love? Who will win?" Yo, yo, I'll, square up, square up. Me and Frank would love to knock you guys down. Let's first go. Of all, I'll fucking start recording that shit next week. Don't start with me, kid. I'm fucking ready. Second of all, we'll get killed. I'm not doubting me and Kylie's skill, but when these two get together, I mean, they're 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 elite. They're legitimately elite, you know? Yeah, yeah no. Are, are we talking about, like, casual hardcore stream on a Thursday, Frankie? Or, like, final fight Frankie? There, there's you two never know what Frank you're going to get these days. Like, he's kind of a basket of randomized goodies. Yeah. Like, he's a, he's a randomizer.jar. <laughs> he's literally the universal randomizer. We just yeah, take like, a break. Yeah. <laughs> he is he is legitimately universal randomizer.jar. Oh my Team god. Arctic Ryan. Circle, baby. <laughs> Team Arctic Circle. Never forget. Ryan, did you see the uh the smart glasses that I got? Dude, yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of looked Bro, into them. I'm obsessed. I ordered a pair that have clear glasses so I could actually wear them in the house. Okay, okay. Yeah, because the ones you have now are tinted. They look like sunglasses. <laughs> they are sunglasses, yeah. So, oh, okay. like, those I could rock outside and, like, go on my runs and stuff. But when I'm in the house, like, I tried... I wore them on stream and in here is fine because there's really bright lights. But, like, in a regular scenario, I, I can't really wear those indoors because they're a little mm -hmm. bit too dark. Mm -hmm. um, Toy King said, damn, I still remember when Vinny was in college doing videos with Dobbs. Dude, damn. I remember... I always remember this whenever I talk about the verses with Dobbs and the college era of my life. I was walking around my college campus. I went to Adelphi University and me and Dobbs were having a legitimate debate and like a very like intense conversation. It was dead serious, no memes about whether or not we should bleep whenever we burped because we were burping a lot in the videos and the comments were actually getting furious with us. And I was like, dude, like, I can't believe they're getting this mad. Like, I don't know what to do. Like, should we cave? Should we not cave? Like, like, what, what should we do here? And we were, like, I was pacing around the campus being, like, should we not post this next episode? Like, should we re-record it and I won't burp this time? Like, the hate's Aww. getting really intense. And I'll, I'll never forget those memories from, like, the college days, man. It's, it's hilarious. Dude, that's crazy. I love it. Well, no, that was also, you guys had the year of verses. Like, consistently, never missed an episode. That was actually crazy. Yeah. Yeah, that was. So, like, if y'all had to make a decision to bleep the burps, like, you had to do it quick so you wouldn't miss the episode that day. <laughs> Bro, we also did, I can't remember, I think, I think we missed an episode in Alola. Um, That's right, someone's not kidding. Up until Gen 7, I'm pretty sure, we did every episode on the day it was supposed to go up for six generations straight, I'm pretty sure, which is actually insane.
That's actually insane. And I'm pretty sure they didn't have breaks. Like, we literally did Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 3, Gen 4, all the way to whatever the most recent gen was. And mm-hmm. then we, like, went back and did hardcore randomize or not hardcore we did like extreme randomizers that's what it was yeah, yeah and then we like took a break then came back with a soul link later on like we we actually have a shitload of content if you guys watch uh me and dob stuff there's there's plenty of stuff yeah. for you guys to watch but yeah let me let me tell you about my idea now okay so yeah, hit me with it. <laughs> i i think I, I might be an idiot dude i have a goldfish memory i think you texted me last night and you're like yo 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 we're gonna do some uh um uh, dual streams or whatever so I've been trying to figure out a better way to balance my current like work situation because the way that it's set up right now is I go live every day on original, obviously, and the streak is very important to me still. And every time I even debate on ending it, it doesn't end. Um, mm-hmm. And I'm just like, listen, I, I want to keep streaming on original, but I also want to keep streaming on Nintendo and build a really solid stream community there and really, you know, do awesome streams there. But also I don't want then the awesome streams there to affect what I'm doing here because sometimes... I'll go live on Nintendo for three hours, be exhausted, record shorts, revise stuff. And then I go live on original and I'm laying in my bed half asleep, exhausted. And that happened like multiple times sometimes in a week. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, you know what? The line has been getting blurred on like what my content is when I go live. Like my last series on Nintendo was a hardcore member series where members could kill Pokemon. And I've done that on on original and i've done mario on nintendo and vice versa i've done radical red and blah 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 and it, it's kind of like if i have a really big event stream idea i could always do that just on nintendo if i want but mm-hmm. when i start a new thing like for example radical red i feel like there's no reason why i can't stream it on both and that's kind of been my mentality the last couple of days where i'm like you know what it could be a train wreck but for a week i want to try dual streaming yeah. And if it works well, that's great. If it doesn't work well, I go back to doing, you know, a different plan. But mm-hmm. to be able to go live on both channels and instead of doing two one-hour streams, do one two-hour stream or mm-hmm. longer, I just feel like the stream content itself would be way better. And also, I won't be wearing myself so thin where it's like, okay, I just streamed on Nintendo. Oh, shit. Now I still got to stream on original. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Because you don't want one channel to get neglected in favor of the other and yeah. vice versa. Yeah. And the bottom line is like, being live on original while I'm live on Nintendo doesn't affect either. It's like, if you want to watch on original, that's cool. If you want to watch on Nintendo, that's, that's cool. And, uh, Lukey helped me today. So I got all of my stuff situated where now I have like two member bars that are live at the same time. So if, you know, people send in 10 gifted members on original, it'll make the original bar go up. And then Nintendo, it'll make the Nintendo bar go up on Nintendo. Um, and the eventual cool. goal is to hopefully fi- fi- figure out a way to combine both into one bar. And then mm-hmm. it would just be like my total members across both channels. And when people gift on original or Nintendo, it just adds to the total that amount accordingly, mm-hmm. which I think would be really, really cool. Dude, that's so sick. And like, yeah. Yeah, like you said, you can just try it out for a week and see how you like it, see how the community likes it and see like if that works out for everybody. And Radical Red's perfect because that's already something that you've established on both channels. Like Exactly. Uh, and you just lost, so, you know, you can start yeah. fresh run. You know? Yeah, and and that, I have a cool plan. I actually already got the thumbnail made. I'm ready to go. This will be my last Radical Red run. You know why? Because I'm going to win. Oh, there it is. All right, so, let me tell you, I got the storylines on deck. And you know what else is cool about doing it on, you know, one, one or both channels at the same time? Mm-hmm. I don't need two separate schedules. Because that was the other thing that was stressing me. It was like, I was going live on original at 1130 in the morning, and I was sticking to that. And I was actually getting, like, a huge... I was garnering a huge audience of people that were watching every morning because they knew, okay, 1130, Vinny's live. Awesome. But then it was like, okay, well, what am I going to have? Like Monday through Friday, 1130 AM on original, then like 4 PM on Nintendo. It's like, no, now I can just pick a time mm-hmm. and, and set everybody it has and go. one place to come to for that time. Yeah. Exactly. That's, yeah. that's the, that's the vibes. We love hey, Vinny, and you're from Gamer Subs. It's always exciting. I've been using Code Vinny like crazy. Let's go, dude. Yo, anytime you use Code Vinny on Gamer Subs, this is my second favorite flavor now, by the way. My first favorite flavor is so depressed. I don't know if you ever tried Gamer Subs, Ryan. It's no, mad good. You should get a waifu cup because they're awesome. And they have waifu shirts too that are really cool. Um, if you ever use my code, please tweet to me like a screenshot of your order so I can say thank you. And yeah, dude, still sponsored by Gamer Subs, 10% off if you use Code Vinny. Thank you so much. Uh, were there any other Pokemon y'all guys uh, would have as a mascot? Believe it or not, my actually, I'm, I'm gonna quiz Ryan. Do you know 
one of the mascots that I had on my channel that wasn't Mew or Charizard? My guess was either Mew or Charizard. <laughs> I had um, I had a substitution uh, Pokemon mascot at one particular point. Do any of you remember? If any of you know this, I'll be very impressed. I don't think I know. Or at least you're going to say it, and then I'll probably know. You definitely will remember when I say it. I just want to wait and see if chat knows. Ah. Uh, because it's always been Charizard or Mew. Historically, it's always been, like, bouncing between those two. But there was a banner, and there was a point in time where there was a new mascot. Not Lugia, not Shroomish. Come on, someone's got to get it. It, it was probably Gen 1, chat. It was probably going to be Gen 1. It wasn't Gen 1. It wasn't you Blastoise. No, was not Jolte. Wow, where are the OGs? No one what? knows this? Was it Gibble for Chompers? No. Wow. It wasn't. <laughs> Yo, the Pirate King got it! It was Salandit! Remember the Wait, art? I remember this. I remember actually, the I remember art that Pertamonium yeah. made? It was me with the with the Pokeball, I'm pretty sure. And then I asked him, can you add a Salandit to my shoulder? Yes! Yeah. <laughs> Yo, my man, my man is getting the gamer subs, and he knows the deep cuts. Let's go. That's awesome, dude. Look, like I said, he said it, and then I knew it. Like, I, I, I knew once... Dude, What's I just remember about? when when Gen Seven got announced, and I saw Salandit. I was like, "Bro, this mm -hmm. is the coolest Pokemon ever." That's I still bolt. think I still think Salandit is so fucking cool. <laughs> he sits on your shoulder so well, bro. He's just like a little parakeet. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm trying to see if I can find. <laughs> where would I find that image? I don't know if I can. Let me see if I can find that. I might have V it. V. We have like the same taste in Pokemon, and I love it. <laughs> Bro, the Vinny and Ryan fusion. I can't wait to watch this back. It's <laughs> yeah. cool. No, that that was a highlight. That was already 100%. A Bro, I mean, the whole series is a highlight, you know. Hey. And listen, I don't know how often we'll do this, but I'm having a fucking blasty blast. Dude, I'm down. I'm down to come back. Oh wait, wait. Oh, I found it without the slant. I I'm try. I think if I search my own Twitter, how do you search your own Twitter on desktop? Um, it's not the search button. Because on mobile, you can go to a page. I think, I think you have to do like a full search and then like use the filters to like say from this account specifically. Um, I think I lost him. Hmm. Hello? We lost each other there. I was reading my old Salandit tweets. <laughs> Wait, you found them? You found them? Dude, I literally said, I don't think you guys understand how much I love Salandit. July 12th, 2016. July 13th. I have decided that Salandit is my new channel mascot. He is beautiful and majestic. The yeah. next day, just ask yourself, what would Salandit do? <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, Salandit was that dude. He was. I'm glad you made a whole tweet just to, like, let the community know he is the mascot now. In and case then, there was any confusion. <laughs> and also in 2016, Salandit is my spirit animal. I think he still is in 2024, actually. It's you actually, would give off, like, Salandit oh, yeah, energy. Yeah. Really, yeah. It's actually so cool to see that when I tweeted sound it is my spirit animal, I got 11 likes in 2016. I wonder how much I'd get. What if I tweeted that right now? Yeah, wait, do it. Do, let's do a little experiment. Same tweet. Same All tweet. All right, let's do it. Salad it is my spirit animal. Yes. All right, bam. <laughs> it is Vincent and Ryan. What's going on? Yo, Squirtle Master. What's going on, dude? Squirtle Master. Kenobi. Welcome to the, to the Vinny and Ryan Super Zoom podcast show. Where you will have a great time, and you'll have a, a long time, and you'll have a time. It'll be a time. Have Look time. down at your watch. Oh my god, Carly's here! What's up, Carly? Dude, hi, everyone's Carly, coming out show. of the Ryan and Vinny Super Zoom podcast show. It's, right now, we're not Zoomed. There's nothing Super Zoom about this podcast. That's true. Listen, well, that's... Well, technically, I am still Zoomed a little bit. See that? Oh. Oh, he was. He was. Yo, I'm I'm streaming right now while my phone is on an, uh, uh, a charger. Um, not NFT. What is the back of the charger? Uh, NFC charger. NFC charger, yeah. Right? 
And uh, my LFT phone charge you. <laughs> my phone feels like a, a piece of molten lava right now. Ooh, ooh, that ain't good. That ain't good one bit. Let me tell you. Oh, oh we already surpassed my 2016 light goal. We did it. We're growing. That is called growth. <laughs> that is that is what was that? 2016. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four. That was fucking that's weird. That means Sun and Moon came out eight years ago. Like Gen 7, slazzle, slammed it. <laughs> That's weird, bro. Isn't it? Isn't Ugh, it? I don't like that at all. No. <laughs> I just... See, that. What, what's weird is there will be a time where eight years go by and we're sitting there going, remember when we went live with the podcast that one night? And, we're gonna like, that was and then we're going to be like, well, that was 16 years ahead of Salandit. It. <laughs> that's fucking, that's fucked up. No, that is fucked up. Vinny, also, I wish I could personally invite you to my wedding in late October if possible. Well, first of all, congratulations. That's so exciting. I hope you have Ooh. the best wedding ever. That's awesome. Pokemon Peak with Gen 7. And Mugs. That's how I feel about that take. <laughs> Have another mid lukewarm take like that again, brother, and you might be out of here. That that's your warning. That's your warning. <laughs> and in case I haven't made myself clear, I'll push that button again. <laughs> what you think just because this is a mobile stream, I can't fucking play sounds? <laughs> you guys are right next to the speaker. Wait a second, wait a second. Can I do it? Right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Dude. we both have a soundboard right now. We Dude, really are I gotta add the best the, podcast. <laughs> I really gotta add the fucking bruh, 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 bruh. Oh, that's Locky a good one. Slunch. <laughs> <laughs> First three gens are unbeatable. Why do me and V continue to have the same exact takes? We're the same human. Let's go. Same human. First three gens. Best gens. Having to replay that whole tutorial Gen 7 was the restart was the worst. Well, didn't they change that in Ultra Sun and Moon? It's better. It's better. Yeah. And the UI looks really cool in Ultra Sun and Moon. It has a little scribbles. I like the scribbles. Bro, I was so excited for Alola, though. Like, I, right. was, I, was, I was fucking ready. I remember I was playing the demo and shit, my cool Hawaiian shirt. Yeah. Oh, my God, there was a demo. Oh, I, dude, I remember, remember I remember I stayed home from class to either stream the demo. Was it streaming then? No, I don't even think I was streaming then. I think I, I probably fucking... videos. It was probably yeah. videos. No, you know what? I did stream that. Wait a second. How could I find that? Because I remember being like, yo, if my professor sees me live, I'm screwed. Because <laughs> he knows that you would have skipped class. <laughs> yeah. Yo, that's crazy. Wow. There's so much shit to go over. Because you're at your almost your 10-year anniversary. Like, there's such a huge catalog when you've been at this for literally every day since, Bro, since the beginning. All I know is, Fry Bry, you want to talk about countdown timers? <laughs> the the 10-year countdown timer is about to be bust and bust. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, dude. You got me excited already, actually. Bro, think about how much content we can pull from. 10 years. 10 years of the entire catalog. <laughs> I, I Listen, not to be, like, overly sappy or anything, but, like, I think about a week of work at the moment, and I'm just like, holy fuck, like, we do so much. To think about, like, when you zoom out and you're just like, yo, we've been doing this for 10 fucking years. Yeah. You gotta be close to 10 years, too, right? My 10 year was in Wait, 2021. Wait, you 10 years already? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm at, like, 12 year, actually. <laughs> That's insane. Well, Frank's 10 years this year, right? Because I remember we had this, we started the same year, I'm pretty sure. Is Frank's 10 year this year as well? You've That's insane. That's since... crazy. <gasps> yeah, you've been, Star Fox 3D Walkthrough Part 1. <laughs> 2011, yeah, 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 I was much like, Yo, you had an intro card and everything. Let's fucking go. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you have commentary on this? Hello there. <laughs> Why are we? We're be doing Star Fox 64 3D walkthrough. Wow. Yeah. So, this is so far my favorite. Bro, first of all, the recording of the screen is crazy, but the fact that it's so dirty. 
<laughs> it's so bad. Dude, I, I I borrowed my mom's camcorder to record that. And so it's Bro. like, it wasn't even focused on the screen. <laughs> Dog, this got uploaded December 17th, 2011. Yep, that's the day. That's the day, yeah. <gasps> that's so crazy. Right. You put the link in the chat. <laughs> Bro, yeah, people gotta see this. <laughs> oh my god. Holy I'm commenting. <laughs> I'm doing the classic, a legend was born. I was just about to say that. I was just about to say that. Wait a second. Gotta wait a second. do it. Oh no. my god. It actually has a lot of comments. Does it actually? <laughs> Dude, it has a lot of comments. It has 32. Let's go. <laughs> that's crazy. I wonder, I feel like that's a very, that's why like I got, I got so upset when YouTube uh, removed the oldest and the yeah. popular and all that because it was like, that was always one of my favorite things to do. Like whether it's a new channel or a channel I've been watching for a long time, like literally going on there and seeing like, Oh, what was their first piece of content? Yeah. How did it grow? How did they change? Or are they still doing the same thing or dude? Yeah. That's, that's awesome. <laughs> bro, bro. Wait. So 51 here. There it is. Yeah. I knew dude. On fans. Original one fifty one here bringing you guys episode one. Of my Pokemon, my Pokemon Fire Red LP. LP. That's right, guys. This is my first LP. Dude, Dude you're so chill. So I know I've told the story about a million and three <laughs> times, but I want to let you guys know, I have I have always been crazy. Like <laughs> that series, that was my first project ever. I just just as a precursor to how insane I would be in the future with like attention to detail and revisions and edits and all this shit. That series was no face cam. And what I would do is, if I would stutter over my words, I would timestamp. And then I would go back and post and re-record what I said <laughs> in the Let's Play episode. So, like, literally, there there are moments in the Let's Play where, like, it's, it's honestly so seamless where you couldn't tell. But uh. it's like a Frankenstein creation of, like, let's say a Pidgeotto went for Sand Attack. And I was like, he went for Sand I would timestamp. Yeah. He went for sand attack and pasted it into the timeline and re-render. Just so that way everything was... I didn't notice. That's that's cool, actually. And it, it was it wasn't like crazy amount of times, but like it was it was a lot. Wow. Like wow. I I've been I've been standing on my business since the start, dude. Since day one, baby. <laughs> so funny. Wait. Maybe a weird flex, but I beat Pokemon Red version at age of seven. It was my last Christmas gift that my dad got me. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I'm really sorry to hear that. I'm so sorry. But that that's honestly an awesome, awesome memory. Like, if you're able to remember that you beat the game when you were seven, like, I feel like I have, I weirdly feel like I remember more of playing Gen 3 than Gen 1. Like, really? I started Gen 1, but my most fond nostalgia comes from hearing, like, the... Like, that <laughs> game, man, is just, oh, it's so good. There's crazy nostalgia there. <gasps> so such crazy nostalgia. Oh. It's it's wild. Um, but yeah, I literally didn't even realize how much time went by. I I told Kylie I was gonna be live for like 20 minutes, and this is a longer stream, but this was really fun. We'll definitely do this again, and maybe we'll do it on Ryan's channel next time and fucking just shoot the shit and talk. But thank <laughs> you all it. for hanging out. You guys are awesome. Ryan, thank you for joining me. Don't and so uh, me and you will chat off cam about next short session and some then we fight stuff and we're gonna cook up some some fire fire content. Also, guys, my birthday is coming up in fucking four days. Literally, let's go. I don't know what the fuck we're gonna stream, but we gotta come up with something cool. It'll it'll be a fun time. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hell I love yeah. that. Thank you guys for watching. We love you guys. See you next time. Oh, and thank you, Craig, for the one month. Go live. Uh, Vinny and Ryan randomly just calling each other and going live. Also, is Ryan's favorite DS game still Star Fox? I'd say yeah. Yeah, I'd say it is. <laughs> I'd say my favorite original DS game would have to be Mario 64 DS because that was the game that came with my original, like, chonky DS. Ooh. That thing was fucking awesome. That's cool. That's a good one. My aunt Deb got it for me. I'll never forget. And I remember that I dropped it. I dropped it going into a restaurant one night and it scraped and I had trauma for the rest of my life from that. Oh, and it still hasn't. You brought up a really sensitive subject there, actually, with the DS yeah. memory. And, and, of course, you know how we have to sign this off, right, Ryan? Well, it's the Super Zoom podcast, so there's only one it's way. the Ryan and Vinny Super Zoom podcast show. Have yourselves a great night, and above all else, keep it super podcasty. Bye, guys. <laughs> peace, peace.